Hello friends, in this video lecture, we will see standards used in data communication and networking. The standards are essential in creating and maintaining an open and competitive market for equipment manufacturers. Standards guarantee national and international interoperability of data and telecommunication technology and processes. Standards provide guidelines to manufacturers, vendors, government agencies and other service providers to ensure the kind of interconnectivity necessary in today's marketplace and in international communications. Generally, data communication standards fall into two categories. These are first one is de facto standards and second one is de jure standard. What is de facto standard? Standards are drawn by the fact or by convention. These de facto standards are not approved by any organization but they have been adopted as standards through widespread use means these standards are generally spread by the people next is the de jure standards the standards are drawn by law or by regulation the standards are legislated by officially organized body here we can say de facto standards are unofficial and de jure standards are official. Let's have some standards used in data communication and networking. First one is International Organization for Standardization that is ISO. This ISO is active in developing cooperation in the realm of scientific, technological and economic activity. Next standard is International Telecommunication Union Telecommunication Standard that is ITUT. This ITUT plays a crucial role in defining the core transport and access technologies that underpin communications networks around the world. We can say today's advanced wireless broadband and multimedia technologies are all powered by ITU standard. This standard is responsible for coordinating standards for telecommunications and information communication technology. Then American National Standard Initiative. It is the main organization supporting the development of technology standards in the United States. NC works with industry groups and it is the US member of ISO that is International Organization for Standardization and International Electrotechnical Commission that is IEC. The next standard is Institute of Electrical and Electronics Engineers that is IEEE. Main purpose of IEEE standard is to foster the technological innovations and excellence for benefit of humanity. Next is Electronic Industries Association that is EIA. It creates physical layer specification for Ethernet that is the main purpose of EIA in data communication and networking. So these are the some common standards used in data communication and networking. For more such videos, stay connected here with the channel, like, share and subscribe. Thank you for watching.